All right, there's nothing I really need. Oh, it's you again. Man-eating plant seed. Does this not break? Interesting. I guess that doesn't break? Weird. Looks like this is the last room. There's our boss. What is this freak? It's a mana bore. Occupied. And its owner doesn't seem too friendly. It's all right. Fine. You want to fight? Then bring it. The buggers had to put mana in this boss's name. What the? They have like some kind of shield? Maybe it's scripted? Damn it. Nothing works against this thing. You need a hand? Who are you? I'm Flom. And if you like living, I suggest you do as I say. Is Morgana? Oh, anime cutscene. Turn into a sword? What on earth? Now let's do this. Okay, then. Normal attacks become trigger attacks when Flom transforms into a weapon. Weapon Aura. Use Weapon's Aura when the gauge beneath the icon is full. Weapon Aura is varied by weapon. Attack enemies to fill your gauge. Bomb transformed into a one-handed sword that you can wield in battle. Use its Weapon Aura to temporarily boost your attack. Close calls will also fill your Weapon Aura gauge. Awesome. Cyan. Oh, this isn't voiced. First things first, we gotta attack the barrier around the monster until it breaks. Bosses have special armor gauges. You can only damage a boss after depleting its armor gauge. When you hit a boss with a weapon it's weak against, an icon of that weapon appears below the armor gauge. Okay, so once you find the weakness, it tells you what it's weak to. Figure out the boss's weaknesses in order to deplete the armor gauge faster. I'm trying to perfect dodge that. It didn't work out. How do I? Let's be prepared for anything. Yeah, okay. Azure Flame. Alrighty, let's get going. Okay, so I guess I'm using... I guess I just have Flom's, like, element? Interesting. An equipped weapon may start glowing mid-battle. While it's glowing, you can unleash a powerful trigger strike. The weapon stops glowing afterward, but will regain its shine over time. How do I do a bigger thing? How do I do that trigger How thing? How should we be fighting? What should we be fighting? Alrighty, let's get going. I don't know how you do that trinity thing. Maybe when my gauge is full. Probably. That's a perfect dodge. Perfect dodge is not telegraphed enough. Hard to tell if you get it. like Trinity thing charge up. Damn. Hey, me? Really? Let's be prepared for anything. How do you use items? L1. L1's items. Hit me up with this. Yeah. Alright, one more, uh, one more, like, barrage of attacks, then we can, like, kill you. 
He's done. Looks like I'm getting better. Special treasure chest appears after you beat the boss. If your inventory is full, it will reappear when you enter the map. All right, cool. I just don't know how to do that Trinity strike. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Square does this. Alrighty, let's get going. Did the game tell let's me that? I don't remember them saying like, "Oh, press this button." Got the attack all right. Whatever that means. Probably like raises attack. You could equip strange gems known as manatite to triggers to gain additional effects. But manatite grant attack related effects and have a red lined icon. Armor manatite grant stat boost and have a yellow lined icon. You can now equip customized weapons, view stats in the thing. Okay. Oh, that was a little close for comfort, huh? <laughs> no kidding. I owe you one. But, uh. Just what are you? Um, your guess is as good as mine. All I remember is my name. As for how I ended up here or what I am, I wish I knew. But that mark on your eye, for some reason, it feels familiar. Have you played Tales of Graces? Seriously? I mean, it's only a feeling though. Like, I should remember it, but don't. Oh. And here I thought I'd finally learn what it is. Just my luck. So, you don't know either? <sighs> nope. Neither did my parents. At least, they never told me. Interesting. Okay, I've got an idea. Take me with you. I'm sorry? That was so abrupt! The only thing even vaguely familiar to me is that mark of yours. If I want to regain my memories, then I have no choice but to follow you. I guess that makes sense. Well, when you put it that way. Plus, if I remember what that mark is, I can tell you all about it. Win-win, right? Besides, I can help you fight, too. Which will come in handy for exploring the armor. All right, deal. Knock yourself out. As long as you tell me whatever you remember, I just gotta know what this mark means. I will. That's a promise. Let's get this adventure started. Okay, then. What's this? Um... Call me crazy, but I think I've seen this before. Hey, don't get too close. Oh, is this gonna take me back to the start with those like three teleporters? Oh, yeah. Where are we? Back at the entrance. Plot convenience. Is this the room by the entrance? <laughs> Seems like that thing warped us here. Probably a teleportation circle or something. <sighs> Look, we're safe, so I'll let it slide this time. But don't mess with that thing again. <laughs> I bet we can find more of these circles whenever we see one. Right. Let's use it. In one ear, out the other. Well, at least it makes leaving here easier. Step on these glyphs to teleport to their twin. To their twin. All right. I see this uh tutorial. Oh, hello. On the bloom. Yes, help. Battle. Normal attacks will become trigger attacks when triggered, transform into a weapon. These attacks can drain your synchro gods, right? Press triangle. Triangle's what we press. They did tell me that. I just... Get ready. All right, well, I just wasted it. Okay. I understand now. Let's just go back. Oh yeah, you can change up your trigger attack combo whenever you want. Trigger attacks are three hit combos. You can customize this combo under the weapon customization in the main menu. 
You swap out two techniques for each slot. Trigger attack comp customization. You can also change attacks with the weapon ring. All right. Might as well take a look at this. Flame edge. So is that like the first hit I do? Flame punch. Okay. What should I look up? Burn and Caliburn. Hm, yeah, there. Oh, okay, these are different. Hm, ta, ha. What should I look up? That one's really cool, actually. Fire Tornado? I gotta see all these. Ha. Yeah. That one's eh. There. Ha. Ta. All right. I like Flame Edge. Fire Tornado is better than Fire Smash, and then Flare Break is better than the other thing. Yeah, that's a good combo. Yeah, Very nice. Very nice. Be gone. Very unnecessary, but I just wanted to use it. What's up? Someone's looking at us. Even the birds have stopped singing. Could it be the thieves I've heard about? <sighs> They're gone. They didn't attack me as I left, so maybe they weren't thieves after all. If you ask me, all that matters now is how fast we can hightail it out of here. Yeah, good idea. What is this character model? Ver Workshop's now in business. Buy and sell materials and manatite there. We what did get a manatite, didn't we? I want to actually, uh, yeah, attack all guy. We might as well put this on if it's all we have. We don't have any armor ones, but they did open the workshop that we can take a look at. Those bunny ears you have? Need something? I come to came to buy some manatite. Got to make sure they're equipped it afterwards. Welcome. What's up? HP booster. I don't have too much Liba. I'd rather save up. Hiya. Come on back, all right? Plus, like, we just started the game. We don't really need too many, uh... We don't need, like, HP and defense right now. They didn't ask me to pick a difficulty option, did they? They might up? not even have difficulty options. I'm not used to it because most games I like most new games just have difficulty options when you run across a game that doesn't have a difficulty option it's a little strange where am I going now how should we be fighting well we we shouldn't let's be prepared for we're in the village I don't know where I'm supposed to go oh to to what's her face fern was her name or something welcome home Sai. What in the world is that? Bow wow. <laughs> uh, okay, it's a dog, I guess? I found him at the Gladius. It seems like he got lost in there. Oh, coming! Is that where Corio? Cyan, someone's here to see you. Pleased to meet you. My name's Elise Quaz, and you must be Cyan, correct? I'd like to hire you for a job. Will you hear me out? Um, I'll go do some shopping while you talk. Make yourself at home, Elise. 
Where did you come from? Also, you have one Is of she them. Your little sister? What a sweetheart. You you just like <laughs> this, this, this this chick just comes in and has this bird who's clearly probably like the same species as Flan. Not species, but like the same thing as Flan. Clearly. So what's the job? Cyan, someone's trying to kill you. You need to leave this town. Now. What the hell? I took care of the guys who were trailing you back at the Arma. Whoa, 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 whoa. One thing at a time. Who's trying to kill me? And more importantly, why? Now you've just confused him. Didn't I say to start with the explanation? You can talk? Huh? You've never met a trigger? But you already have one with you. Uh... We kinda just met, actually. Yeah, it's been a- it's been a crazy day. So you didn't summon this one. My apologies. I shouldn't have jumped to conclusions. My name is Waz. Like your friend there, I am also a trigger. Waz. Waz. That's how you pronounce that? Uh, you keep using that word, but I have no idea what a trigger is. Flan. Flam and Waz. Beings given form by those with great power. We grant our summoners power in kind. You grant power to whoever summons you. The the triggers do look like Pokemon, which is actually like I can because I think I read that Pokemon people from Pokemon like help with the game. I can definitely see Pokemon people who worked on Pokemon designs like I can see them designing these triggers because they do look reminiscent of Pokemon. I am a water trigger, by the by. Your friend appears to be a fire trigger. I would explain the name. Th then who summoned you, Was? Elise, of course. Yep, cool, right? But let's return to the topic at hand. You know about the gods of order and chaos, don't you? Yeah, who doesn't? I played many SMT games. They fought each other in some huge war a long time ago, right? Almost. The truth is... That war never ended, only now it's a proxy war fought by god warriors who bear emblems like your own. God warriors? Your eye bears a crest called the Chaos Emblem. It means you've been chosen to fight for the gods. So you're saying this thing in my eye is called an emblem? Correct. Proof that you're the warrior of Chaos. Wait. Seriously, hold on. You're going way too fast for me. Listen, I know this is a lot to take in, but just remember, you have a target on your back. Okay, fantastic. But why do I even have to fight in this proxy war in the first place? Because it's your destiny. At least, that's what the gods think. Alright, well settled. Can't go against destiny. But I want to change your destiny. It's the whole reason I'm here. Change my destiny? How? By convincing the Warrior of Order that you shouldn't fight each other at all. My words won't hold much weight with them, but they might hear you out. Anything to stop this senseless bloodshed. Please, Cyan, you have to help me. Man, fine, I I'll do it, whatever. Just stop groveling, alright? So, someone was after me at the Arma. Maybe you really did chase them off. But I'm still not totally convinced. If I find out you're lying, I'm gone. Got it? That seems fair. That's perfectly fine. Thank you, Cyan. So, where are we going? A place called Stahl. It's just beyond the Aldo Desert to the east. Stahl? Like from Star Ocean 5? I'm pretty sure that's the exact spelling, too. Man, this Elise chick really came out of nowhere. My parents would have known something about this, Mark. Why do you think that? My dad was a knight of Stahl. At least, that's what I heard. I just doubt this is all a big coincidence. Call it a hunch. Well, it sounds like a good lead to me. Hey, Cyan? What was your dad like? Well, he was... kind. And strong. Taught me all I know about swordplay. <laughs> Wasn't my real father, though. He just raised me as if I were his own kid. So, who are your real parents, then? I don't know. I heard they died after I was born. 
Uh-oh. I'll stay quiet for a bit. <laughs> 